If you've driven downtown along Denver Avenue, you might have wondered about the little diner at 2nd Street. There's nothing fancy about the Denver Grill, and maybe that's why it has survived almost 70 years, making it one of the city's oldest places to eat. Would you like some more coffee? Please. The Denver Grill gets most of its business from regular customers, many who work around downtown. Here you go, Don. This is quaint. This reminds me of my era. You know, it's just, it's quaint. It's nice. The people are nice. When I was growing up, this place, I, didn't, I don't think it even had a lock on the front door. That's what I remember was that it was always open. You know, when we were, when I was, when I was in high school, after we got through partying and stuff, we came down here. The doors aren't open 24 hours anymore, but that's one of the few things that has changed. The place first started serving hot coffee and home-cooked meals back in 1933. At that time, Tulsa had many similar cafes, especially downtown. But the competition from fast food and takeout places killed many mom-and-pop diners, but the Denver Grill manages to hang on. He's great. Peggy Jones is the owner of the Denver Grill. In 1963, she began working here as a waitress along with her sister. She liked the place so much that she bought the Cozy Diner in the 1980s. From the day I started, I knew this is what I wanted to do. So I was never interested in anything else. It just means everything to me. It's, it's all I know. I, I never worked anywhere else, never wanted to work anywhere else. So, it, you know, it's everything to me. Peggy has kept the Denver Grill pretty much the same as it was 50 years ago. From the individual jukeboxes at each table to the recipes back in the kitchen. Well, we make our own bread. Um, meatloaf, you know, everything. We, we don't have anything frozen. So, pretty much like it always was. There you go. Oh, mercy, thank you. Peggy's two daughters, Linda and Carolyn, also worked here when they were young. I remember I coming here as a little girl and sitting up here at these booths and having my arms up here, just watching my mother walk around and wait on all these tables. I was so proud of her because she can wait on people left and right. See, I started <laughs> working here. At 13. 13. Washing dishes. <laughs> the little Denver Grill has turned away offers from bigger companies that would demolish the building and turn the property into something else. So for now, the little grill, with memories of yesteryear, manages to survive in this hurry-up world. You know, there's so many people who look at a place like this and they come in and say, oh, well, you know, you could change this or you could do that. And you... No. You, you gotta, it, there's something about just maintaining what it is. See you later, Donnie.